Good morning, babes. It's Curlisa Victoria. I am back with yet another video. If you guys are new here, hi, welcome to my channel. If you've already been subscribed, thanks for coming back. Make sure you guys smash the subscribe button. No, no, no. Y'all, I'm about to go to the gym, so I'm not gonna lie to you. Since I got my membership back from the gym, for the gym, your girl has been in the gym probably almost every day with the exception of one or two. I think really with the exception of like one. Um, just trying to get back. So I'm headed there now. Um, I need to drop this stomach fat off, okay, because it's hanging and I'm over it. So I'll see y'all in the car. Okay, hey babe. So Sync has connected your phone and is remote. I just wanted to do a quick follow up. Man, what the hell? I just wanted to do a quick follow up real quick, let y'all know. Okay, so I um I know I just talked to y'all in the house, but I weighed in at 163.8 pounds again today, which was the same weight as yesterday. Over the last week or two I've been having I've been questioning my scale like I don't know if it's calibrated properly or if it needs to be recalibrated or if my weight is truly what it is but I'm the exact same weight as yesterday um, I did notice this morning that my belly looks it just looks so bloated to me um, so I am definitely gonna be drinking uh, taking my probiotics and I think my beverage consumption is gonna boil down to like tea and water hot tea no tea water coffee that's it and I have to of course drink enough water because uh, drinking too much tea and coffee without having drink water is not a good thing um, so I'm gonna be in the gym I don't know what workout I'm doing today I don't know how long I'm gonna be there um, I might get back on the weights because I, like I told you guys I'm trying to build my glutes but I also want to you know get rid of some fat so I may there's a possibility that I may just get on the same machines that I'm getting on often don't think I'm doing leg press if I do anything like hardcore leg today, I think it's going to be the Stairmaster. Um, or I'm gonna do hit workouts on the treadmill where I walk and run back and forth. Um, just simply because it's just, <sighs> your girl has been working out. I need to probably take a rest day, even though it's like my goals are in front of me. So it just keeps making me wanna go to the gym. Um, everybody dropping a trash off right now. I just wanna. But let me go pull up um, so I can drop my trash off and get going. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. <coughs> and I'll see y'all in the next video. Um, or I'll see y'all in a little bit. You got trash too? No, no, that's tacky. Girl, I swear, everybody's dropping their trash off. Let me touch y'all a little Okay, y'all, so I was about to get a matcha latte, but I think I might get a brown shake and espresso instead because I am running low on coffee at home. I mean, running low on, well, I don't know. I'm running low on creamer, but I, I don't know if any of these locations have any. I feel like this vlog is all over the place. So look, y'all, I went to the gym today. Gym workout was amazing, but let me tell you, I got into a riff and I didn't, I, baby. I was just telling, I was, mm -mm. look, I was literally working out on the weights and went to go to get on the leg press machine. Mind you, it's only one leg press machine in the whole entire freaking gym. This girl is going back and forth between equipment, but I'm trying to use the leg press. So she's doing reps and sets on different pieces of equipment. I said, um, are you done with this leg press? Because I'm trying to use it. She's, oh, I'm done. Mm, that was a lie. Okay, because you're not done because you left all of your stuff over there and went to go work out on another machine as though you were going back and forth and you wanted people to see somebody's stuff is here so somebody's using it. When she first got up, I'm like, okay, surely she's going to come back and get her stuff and wipe the stuff down. Like she left her stuff and maybe she's going to walk away, go get some cleaning solution, wipe her station down and then take her stuff. 
no baby went over to the other equipment to keep working out so then she said oh I'm done over here I said oh, okay you left all your stuff oh so she went to go get her stuff I said but you gonna wipe are you gonna wipe down the station and she said she flipped her hair and walked away so I moved my headphone I had on my beats so I had to move the earmuff I said um what did she just say and the guy was like oh I don't know you got to take that up with her you got to go see so I walked over there and I went to go ask her I said are you gonna clean up your you know your station she she said um no I said excuse me and she's like no I'm not I said well I'm not gonna wipe up your sweat but I am gonna use that machine so I'm gonna can you go wipe that station this girl flipped her hair and said you can do it I mean I'm not gonna flip because <laughs> I ain't got time for all that energy but she flipped her hair and and basically told me I can go do it I had to look every direction there was in the gym to see who the, she thought she was talking to so I said I don't know who you think you talking to da, 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 but the young lady at the desk who worked there she seen the whole thing and had sent the other manager over because she was seeing the whole thing and he came to defuse it and do you know that this girl basically stated that everything that I told him was accurate was true because she tried to justify her not cleaning the station because oh she's talking loud she's yelling I said in the beginning I asked very nicely but when she's flinging her hair in my face and telling me that I can clean up I'm just like Um, so I'm basically like, um, no, she told the guy that, oh, she's talk, she's yelling, da, 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 so she didn't. I'm like, is that justification as to why not following the protocol? It's COVID, like, you know what I mean? It's definitely COVID, so you should already know about sanitation. But even prior to COVID, when I used to go to that gym, I used to be wiping down my station before COVID even came about. That's just a sanitation factor. That's why they have sanitation and napkins and all that stuff for you to wipe down your equipment. And baby, when I tell you, she basically tried to act like that was justification as to why. And the guy was like, no, you need to clean down your station. And she still refused to do it. And he wiped it down to defuse the situation, but he didn't have to do that. But for that, that was a good managerial intervention because it's like he did it for the sake of the, the peace of the situation. But he was like, you do need to wipe down your equipment. So, he, so basically, if the girl doesn't wipe her equipment down anymore, she's going to get her whole entire membership banned. He said, because you're absolutely right. I said, that's like if you go to wipe your, that's like you, me saying, um, you going to wipe your butt? And somebody saying, no, you can do it. A grown person saying, no, you can do it. Excuse me, what? I'm not cleaning up your, I'm not wiping your butt. That's the same type of, to me, that was the same correlation. I said, this girl has really lost her marbles. But yeah, of course somebody going to get frustrated if you sit here telling them, no, you're not going to clean up behind yourself in a gym like this. After all of this, I said, I don't know where she's been this whole entire pandemic or even before that when it came down to sanitation. But she's got another thing coming if she thought. And I'd just be grateful because it's like when you think about having so much to lose as an individual and somebody in an instance can literally get you to a place where you smack the heck out of them or you do something that can literally. I, I wasn't with you. So. Okay, y'all, my camera keeps dying, but I'm going to go to the pharmacy vegan kitchen instead of getting the matcha latte. And I guess I'll just fill y'all in once I actually do all of that and get all of that. Um, my camera. So a lot came up since I went to the pharmacy vegan kitchen. I did get a good amount of things, which I'll talk about in the next vlog. But I'm going to go ahead and end it here. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. As always, love you.